Hello, it's Divine Needle. My name is Nell. Uh, last night I was streaming and I missed some people uh, for doing a free reading for, right? And <clears throat> I'll try to do some readings for them. Yeah, I cannot promise I will do everybody. But this person, I missed it, her or him, I think it's her, uh, two times. Yeah, but I will be doing a reading for you right now. I don't, don't have a question of you, so mm, I will do a reading and apply your question to your reading. That's the best advice I can give you. But yeah, the name is Sunshine. Okay, uh, she's been tuning in, or he, and uh, yeah, called her out, then left, right? Which is understandable, it takes a long time. It's logistics of how I do it. Uh, if I don't do it like that, people might get mad. So try to catch up, right? I can do. I cannot do everybody. No, I'm just one person, and I don't want to cut the reading short. I do not want to do that at all. No. But yeah, there you go. Free reading for you, sunshine. I pre-shuffle this deck with your energy into it. And let's see what comes out for you. Right? Hope you're having a good weekend. Current situation for Sunshine. Current situation. Page of Wands. What's the challenge with the Page of Wands? What's the challenge with the Page of Wands? Knight of Cups. been going down recent past for sunshine it's been going down recent past for sunshine five of swords it's gonna go down in the near future for sunshine two popped out world card and queen of wands okay What's the focus of sunshine right now? Ooh, okay. Ten of swords. What's going on in subconscious? What's the advice for sunshine? Six of Wands. Cool. That's some good advice. Okay, how do you see yourself or want to see yourself? Temperance. How do others see you or want to see you? How does your environment Take this one. These kips. Hope some fears for our sunshine. Eight of cups. What's gonna be the final outcome for sunshine? Ooh. Six of coins. Okay. Bottom of the deck energy, Knight of Wands. Taking action, this is the biggest action card in the deck for me. Maybe the tower might be a little bit more, but um, yeah, it's definitely going out and do it. And it is Wands, so it's passion. Could be a love or any other projects you have going on. Actually doing it, that's the theme I feel. Okay, bottom of the deck energy underlying right okay current situation for you sunshine learning as much as you can before you dive in deep okay uh, this could be a person uh, could also be yeah wants what you're passionate about right we're trying to learn as much as you can about the situation before you take action okay 
We could also indicate that uh, you want want to take a strategic approach to whatever you're passionate about, to whatever you want to do. Okay. The challenge. Knight of Cups. Now, this might be a person coming in that might block you from learning more. Right? Could also be the energy of somebody coming in. Uh, yeah. With love. Yeah. Might throw you off in some way. Yeah. It could also be you. Um, you must be learning as much as you can before you take action in love. You could see it that way too. That's what I feel about it. Yeah, it's leaning towards one of those two. You will know what that is, but that's what I feel. So, taking action. It could also be signifying that you're waiting on somebody to take action towards you. If that resonates. But, yeah. Okay, recent past. Five of swords. She did a victory at any cost. This could be you or somebody did this to you. It is swords, so it is in the mental realm. Okay. It could also indicate criminal behavior around you. Hmm. Do not know how that resonates, but it feels like somebody did you wrong in some way. Okay. Near future for you. I feel the situation with learning as much as you can, right? Somebody coming in or blocking that. That might be resolved because we do have the world card here. Yeah. That's the ending of a cycle and a new one beginning. Well, this one is usually, well, for me, it's usually a ending of a cycle, right? And waiting for the new one to begin. So, uh, this is more of an ending to me personally, okay? But it's a big cycle, ending, big cycle. Do not know how that resonates. And that could be with a person, okay? That could be with a person because um, in the recent past, she did a victory, right? And that cycle ending, it could be about a person. That's what I felt with this. Uh, somebody did you wrong, right? Usually I see this card very positive, but uh, in this reading, I do not. Yeah. Let's see, what's she wearing? She's wearing a mask, okay. So that might be an ending with a person in your life. Okay, a person that did you wrong. Just saying, okay. That's what I feel about it. Current situation, thoughts. Usually this indicates a release of the mental burdens, but uh, to me in that position, no. That is still going on. I feel it's like ramping up and it's like to the maximum what you can handle in the mental realm. Um, yeah, that is going on. Whatever happened in the recent past for you, it, I feel it's still really, um, Bugging you, big time. Okay. Miss Sun Sunshine or Mr. Sunshine, do not know. What they do want you to focus on, yeah, subconscious telling me that you should focus on victory over the situation. This could be over this person, okay. Because, yeah, I do also feel that you should focus on what you do have victory over okay it's funny because you have cheated a victory here in the past and maybe you have to see it as a victory for you like if this is a person that the cycle's ending with right see it as a victory yeah however that applies to you but that is the advice for you Okay. How do you see yourself or want to see yourself? You want to see yourself balanced, I feel. It could also indicate patience, but I feel it's more of a balanced thing in your reading. Okay. 
want to see yourself balanced in your life and it could be with these wants and these passions and these uh, mental anguish things going on with you okay you want to see yourself balanced in your life how others see you or want to see you they want you to have new love in your life this could be uh, a love for yourself okay they want you to have a new love however that applies to you this could even be a new dog okay <laughs> new cats in your life doesn't have to be romantic but yeah they want you to have some sort of new love a new spark that's what i feel hopes and fears for you eight of cups emotional stagnation and walking away from it to an unknown destiny wow that's the original of this uh this could be a fear of you but it could also be a hope okay walking away from something it doesn't have to be emotional stagnation but uh i see this card more in a positive sense i see this card as leaving a situation to go on a new adventure yeah hope that makes sense but yeah the adventure is unknown okay now whatever the situation was with this right she did a victory victory this new cycle it's person if it is really a person i feel you're gonna have some sort of justice with that this could be in the coin realm and material right this is equal give and take it's in the final outcome equal give and take fairness energy okay could also indicate sharing that you might share something with somebody okay this could be money but it could also be ideas or yeah something in the material world but um yeah it's definitely fairness energy in your final outcome so i feel whatever this was she did a victory right these cards there's gonna be some balance with that okay because it also indicates that you want balance. If that is true, I do not know. Let me know if that resonates. But um, yeah, you're going to find some balance in the situation. So that's your future cards. Balance. Ending with a person. I do feel that in this reading. I might be wrong, but I do feel that. And I'm ending with that person. A cycle ending. So there you go, sunshine. I'm sorry that I missed you two times, <laughs> but uh, here you go. Uh, I really do hope you like this um, video. Yeah, I am gonna pull a angel card for you too. Just a little bonus key, right? A little bonus for you. Let's see what comes out. Oh. Healthy lifestyle. Archangel Raphael, eat a healthful diet, get adequate sleep, and exercise regularly. Regular, regularly. Regularly. For optimal health. Yeah, my English ain't up to par. Here you go. Hope that applies to you. I don't feel that at all in this reading, but there you go. There's a little bit of. Uh, yeah, advice from angels, I guess. There you go. Uh, do comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, you can also donate if you feel like doing that. You can donate any amount that you feel is equal to your reading. Uh, yeah, and join us this evening. Yeah, come and share your energy. Okay, will be very much appreciated. And uh, yeah, awesome, awesome reading. Take this as a heads up. I uh, do hope it really hope it resonates with you. Uh, yeah. See you later. And thanks for watching. Bye bye.